Hi guys, welcome back. So this video inspired from a store that I went to at the mall. I saw this sweater and it has this nice glittery angel wings on the back of it. But then when I saw the price tag, it was about $50. So I was like, what the mother father? Grandpa, grandpa is that? $50 for a sweater? I'm like, girl, I can make one just like that for less than $5. Because that $50, I can use it to buy me some hot Cheetos for 99 cents and 50 back of that will make me really happy. I hope you enjoy this video. So this is the old sweater that we're gonna be using and I'm gonna put the angel wing on the back of this and what we're gonna do is we're just gonna turn it around, place it on our table and grab a blank sheet of paper and what I did is I sketched an angel wings on the sheet. So for those people who doesn't know how to sketch an angel wings, you can always go to Google and type in angel wings and you'll see different kind of angel wings design and you can just click on the image and it will show you different pictures and different type of angel wings you want and you can always print it out you can only make one angel wings because we can just flip it it's gonna be the same thing anyway just one is enough so i'm gonna be cutting the angel wings so after cutting your angel wing, just place it on the back of your old sweater or t-shirt. And now as you can see, it does fit and I will grab the fabric that we're gonna be using. So grab your fabric and fold them in half because we are making two wings. So we want to secure it with a needle on the side of the fabric. So when we cut it, they're really secure and it won't disalign. And then place your wing on top of the fabric. Pin it with the needle so it will be secured in the fabric so grab your fabric scissors and remember when cutting a fabric always use a fabric scissors because fabric scissors cut fabric fine and dandy versus regular scissors because regular scissors are not used for fabric so this is how it looks like it looks nice and pretty this is optional it depends on you on how you want the wing to be attached on the back either you sew it or apply a fabric glue if you don't know how to sew um, i'm just gonna sew it by hand because at the meantime my sewing machine is broken so i'm just gonna hand sew it so if you are gonna be sewing the wings on the back try to pin them with the pins so it will be secured but if not if you're just gonna be gluing it on then you don't need to pin it and that's about it guys so this is how it looked like from the back it's simple and easy and fun and i hope you enjoyed this video thank you for watching cut my share bye